We, my husband and I, have been talking about drafting our will over the last few years. We have had various discussions with our lawyers and a few institutions with a view to arriving at the best possible structure. However, we really didn't get to putting everything together before his untimely passing. As we have an unexecuted will, the first few issues I had to deal with in my head was the growing list of financial tasks that my husband had been responsible for and which I had no single idea as to how they ought to be done. For the record, my husband has been solely responsible for running our financial lives, savings, investing, etc. What was particularly overwhelming for me was not knowing how much we had in his accounts and other investments and the fact that our wills remained unsigned didn't help matters. How was I supposed to start fending for the family? To further compound the issues, all the passwords to our various accounts were locked in my husband's head. None written down. Going through probate was not anything near exciting. It took us close to three years before we managed to get a letter of administration appointing me as the administrator of our estate. This was not without any battles. Family members were questioning my right to be so appointed and wondering if I didn't have a hand in his death. The only thing that kept us going financially before we obtained probate was the insurance that he had set up, naming me as the sole beneficiary in the event of his untimely death. The money we got was truly a lifesaver. Well, well, uh, this it's it's you'd be uh, amazed how many of us have a story that they can tell of a friend, a relative, someone they know who's uh, found themselves in this sort of situation. But let's get straight into it. It's a desperate situation for anyone to find themselves in. However, what were the fundamental issues that we should be dealing with here? Let's start with you, Mufulika. Okay. When a lot of people come and they talk about estate planning process, they say, oh, they've had discussions, they've invited professionals, they've spoken with lawyers, and um, they've commenced the process of estate planning. That is not estate planning in itself. Rather, is the process of, you know, speaking with them, getting the right um, advice, and finalizing the process. That is estate planning. Mm. and um what we've highlighted here fundamentally is the fact that you know procrastination plays a major role in the lives of people they say oh they'll get around to it they've started the process eventually at some point in time it will be concluded but here we can see the situation or the quagmire that has been created by not completing the process and um putting the woman in this kind of situation.